Hello, this is going to be a video for anyone that's having issues printing with their Oki white toner printer out of Digital Factory version 10. We're going to talk about whether you're hooked up via Ethernet and then at the end we'll talk about if you're hooked up via USB. So if you're hooked up via Ethernet, the first thing you're going to do is go to Q, Manage Q, and then click the port TCP IP. And if the printer shows up here, you can just go ahead and click on it, hit OK close and you should be able to print just fine that way. Here's an example of what you might see if you're having a port issue. You'll go up and hit print. It'll go through the activate sequence but then when it goes to printing you're gonna get some type of error. It might tell you a specific type or it might just say unknown error like mine does here. So the first thing you'll do is you'll just right click that, hit the clear error button right there, then go Q, manage Q, same thing that we did before, TCP, IP, but this is if your printer doesn't show up in this list here. What you're going to need to do then is you're going to need to go into remote printing and you're going to need to type in your IP address. We can see the IP there, but if you don't see it, how you're going to do that, you're going to go to your printer, hit the menu button, go down to configuration, go down to network, go down to IPv4 address, and right there you should see your IP address. You can take a picture of that and then go and import it into this screen here. After you've imported the numbers here, all you're gonna do is hit the validate connection button. Make sure that it says your connection has been validated successfully like it says there. And then you'll hit okay and close. And then you should be able to print just fine now. Which like it's, you can see here, it is now working and that's what you're looking for. So. That's what you do if you're having issues and it's plugged in via Ethernet. Now if you're hooked up via USB, same thing, you're having an unknown error. You go to Q, Manage Q, click the port option. Now if you don't see one that says OK Data, either it is plugged in wrong into your printer or it's plugged in wrong on your computer or your USB cable isn't working, one of those type of errors because it should show up like that. So if you go in and plug it in correctly, open up the port, you can see one that says Okidata Corp. You'll just click that one, close out of this menu, clear out the error like we did on the previous one, and we should be able to print. And that is what you'll need to do if you're hooked up via USB. So now you can see it's working just fine and that's what we're looking for. So thanks for watching. You're welcome to comment or contact us if you have any more questions. But thanks for watching, guys.